So it's the grand finale of summer <laughs> and between back to school shopping and that those last minute cabin getaways now might be the perfect opportunity to take a minute to check in with your child about their mental health. So all new this morning, Barrett Leone shows us why. The statistics are unsettling. We've seen a lot more anxiety, a lot more social anxiety, a significant increase in school refusal. And that's been a really hard thing. According to the latest Youth Risk Behavior Survey from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, 40% of teenagers say they constantly feel sad or hopeless. That's a lot of our teenage population. And so we want to make sure they're getting help and they're getting support and that they're being seen. It's why experts in the field like Dr. Joshua Stein say now is the time to check in with your teen. When the school year starts and kind of the foot gets on the gas again and the stressors come back, whether they're social, academic, being back in school, everything just kicks right back up. It's a sentiment NAMI Minnesota Executive Director Sue Abderholden echoes. If you don't talk about it right, then you're not getting the help that you need. She urges parents to look for changes in their teens, shifts in sleep patterns, appetite, or lack of interest in things that typically excite them. I'd love to see that number come way, way down. The survey does show a slight improvement from a few years ago, but it's still roughly 10 percentage points higher than a decade ago. 40 percent, that is a huge percentage of kids who are just not feeling great about the world, right, and are depressed. Abder Holden credits that progress to conversation, but she doesn't want it to stop there. It shouldn't be a secret, right? We should be able to talk about it openly so that kids are really aware of what to do. Barrett Leone, WCCO News. Now, NAMI does offer free classes and support groups for parents of children who are struggling with their mental health, and we will share more on that at WCCO.com. And please remember, if you or a loved one is experiencing a mental health crisis, you can always call 988.